So Willard Batteries has been around in South Africa for 70 years, locally manufactured. Uh, this year is our celebration year. We've been involved in several community projects where we do sponsorships, we give back to the community and uh, we feel that this really enforces our brand and our awareness to the environment. We also locally manufactured in Port Elizabeth for which we do a lot of local employment. Our batteries are specifically designed for the South African market and into Africa we also do exports to specified African countries and Europe. Willard as you know has been a household brand for many years. Willard has also been selected as battery brand of the year three years in a row. We have to look at the risk involved in today's farming and uh, communities and agricultural business. Um, I think uh, when it comes to what they've been doing and the methods that they've been used, uh, the methods and the risks plays hand in hand. Um, the risk is obviously changing and uh, that's where digitalization comes in, uh, looking at uh, crop support, weather patterns and um, just securing almost uh, the surety of, of the crop at the end of the day. With the use of renewable energy as, as the backbone of that, we can ensure that uh, the risks are mitigated and that forecasts are accurate. There's a lot of opportunities being locked currently due to digitalization in the agriculture cultural site, um, if we look at weather, weather pattern forecasting, farmers can accurately forecast their rain and, and their wind seasons, uh, which is perfect to the correct time location for planting and um, we can even look at water management, uh, which is a big risk factor, it's, it's basically water and weather that plays hand in hand. Um, you can even do soil conditions and obviously there's a big environmental impact on the soil which can now be managed much better with the use of technology. We're fully focused on renewable energy. Um, all of the items mentioned as, as previously needs to be powered and needs to have an energy source at the end of the day and that's where we play a key role in providing that sustainable energy um, but also doing it in an environmental friendly way through wind, solar and, and water energy. So for Nampu this year I think our main focus is, is to clear out a lot of myths to the end consumer. There, there's a lot of um, different opinions around solar energy for example, wind energy and I think our goal is, is to bring surety to the end user at the end of the day and do the explanation of what is actually um, brought to the table to assist them and that it is cost effective, that there will be a saving at the end of the day. And for us it's all about keeping the wheels rolling. So we'll also be featuring our 70 year celebration through a competition element. So please look out for that during the course of the year. Well I would like to thank all its loyal users over the 70 years that we're celebrating. Without you this was, would not have been possible. Um, we look forward to continuing another 70 years and more into the future.